Welcome Father, back to the Not So Berry <laughs> Challenge. I am continuing right where I left off in the last part where um, Emerald got invited to the Humor and Hijinks Festival here by Bobby. We just congratulated her on her engagement. I think for once this is actually just going to be them two and it's not going to be like a, a club hangout. Um, which side do we want to join for this humor and hijinks festival? I think we'll do, um, let me see her skills. Does she have any mischief skills? She might because sometimes she trolls the forums. She has level two and then comedy she has level three. Okay, maybe we'll join the jokesters together. And it looks like when you get invited to one of these events, you just have to eat food as like the required thing. <laughs> That's kind of random, but sure, we can do that. She is gonna grab some pho. Vanessa. Emerald, Pari Chandran and I really hit it off. We're officially dating now. Bro, what? In the last part, he texted her like, oh, you didn't tell me she was in a relationship. Well, I guess it was all misunderstanding and now they're together. Yay! That's cute. I was actually planning to have her try to get Hudson and Sakura together today because I was like, okay, I guess Pari has a secret boyfriend we don't know about. <laughs> Apparently not. Sakura is the only one in the friend group I think that's single now. Oh no. <laughs> oh, Pari just said I spoke with Hudson and find him quite pleasing. Well, yeah, you're dating now apparently. Looks like Emerald isn't used to eating spicy food. And she's struggling with chopsticks. I was thinking of re-subbing to the refuge and starting a new character. Please convince me not to, lol, unless you wanted to play it with me. Oh girl, you know we're gonna encourage you to do that. <laughs> I love their random um, texts. Oh yay, Bobby actually got food and came and sat with us. Alright, let's chat with her. She has to pee, but like... Uh, actually, we have to join this stupid team. Not that I really care. We might leave this festival. Maybe we just came for food. <laughs> Screw the hijinks festival. Humor and hijinks. I don't care about that. Um, I'm just gonna have them talk instead. Debate some game strategy with her. Why is this girl like full on in a gown? I think you're at the wrong event. Let's make funny faces even though we're not even participating in the festival. Comedy level four. Cool. <laughs> They're both like famous streamers. So if they were to post pictures from this event on their social media, that would probably get them a lot of likes. <laughs> All right, well, that was nice. Spending some time with Bobby. She probably wanted to meet up, get the scoop on her engagement and how that went, but I think I'm gonna end and go home and try to finish that video game that I had her making in the end of the last part. I really wanted to finish it in that part, but we didn't end up doing it because of that rule where we have to say yes to every hang out we are home and we are paying the bills which leaves her with almost no money now <laughs> i still haven't done emma's makeover because i just um started recording this right after the last part but i will do that i swear as soon as she finishes this video game so emma ages up on saturday so i'll have to try to focus on the milestones or whatever i have no idea about any of that because i've never played with an infant actually until now so i'll have to look into all those things She's finally done! Oh my god, that took her so freaking long. We're calling it Science Baby Simulator. It's basically a game where you raise a science baby. <laughs> she is so freaking tired. It's 5 a.m. and she still hasn't slept, but she has to give Emmett a bubble bath because he crapped himself. And he has to come first, so <laughs> she just has to push through the exhaustion. This will be a lot cuter once I give him his makeover. He is angry. He's so tired. Come on, girl. Put Emmett to bed. Wait, why does he still have bubbles on his head? Okay, apparently Emmett's gonna sleep on the bathroom floor. <laughs> what is happening? I heard um, the infants are kind of glitchy. She's going to try to make coffee. No, just put him to bed and you can go to sleep. She's probably gonna pass out before she can do that. Why does he still stink? She just gave him a bath. Whatever. Oh, she passed out. <laughs> she tried. It is kind of a struggle. Well, she decided <laughs> she decided she was ready to have a baby now, so I guess she's gotta deal with the consequences of that. Alright, girl, go to sleep. <laughs> what a struggle, dude. She left the stank diaper on the floor. Oh well. <laughs> she can deal with that in the morning. Actually, does she have work? 
She does have work. Shoot, okay. She has work very soon. <gasps> Wait, she needs to call off. I know she hasn't been to work in forever, but like she's literally dead. Um, or we could take a moodlet solver. Do we have any? We do. Let's ever take one of those instead. Actually, maybe we should stay home again because <laughs> we have to work on some of the little dude's um, milestones. Do they work on spooky day? I'm not even sure if she's supposed to work, but we don't have any vacation days left. Shoot. Um, let me negotiate a bonus. <laughs> we need some money and she has a brand sponsorship. Use the drone to get some fishing shots. Ugh. She doesn't want to go fishing. She's just going to upload the one video she already had, like her pregnancy cooking video. They'll still pay her for that. Yay, she got a bonus. I didn't even see how much it was, but at least we got some money. And I am gonna have her take a moodlet solver because what better time to take one than now? She needs it now more than ever. Let's hype the next video and then we'll go ahead and upload that. Ooh, the money's starting to come in. Nice. Okay, they gave us a hundred bucks. Not much, but it's something. And she already had the video just sitting there, so we might as well. Oh, and she got media production level two. It looks like they actually don't work on Spooky Day. I'm gonna have her come upload a viral video over here on her social networking thing, share an image, do all the things. We're gonna also hack the Lothario Trust Fund, get some more money. Dang, her followers are not liking her stuff today. <laughs> uh -huh. Emmett is still sleeping, so I'm taking advantage of this very rare piece that she has to um, just work on some stuff on the computer. She's doing a side job for programming. What if we stream with the drone while she's doing this programming? Doing like a behind the scenes, work from home with me type stream. Cause I think she can get tips while streaming. Oh, she's a three star celebrity now, dang. She's a B-lister. Okay, she got her money and the baby is now awake. Perfect timing. All right, I'm gonna go and do the makeover. Also make over the house a bit. I will be back in a sec. Okay, so Emmett's makeover is finished. I decided to cut way back on the amount of hair he had. He aged up with a full on set of pigtails, but he is a super young baby. So a lot of babies are almost bald, if not fully bald. So I went with like this very wispy, hair and since he had the green hair i took that as um he has emerald's natural hair color which makes sense because he is a science baby based only on her dna he's probably gonna look like her clone except the boy version <laughs> but yeah so he's got her natural like um auburn brown hair and here is his everyday look it's formal his sleepwear. I had to use this bear one. There's just no way I could not use it. And his party wear. Hot weather. And a cold weather. All right, so I finished the makeovers on extended family members and renovated the house a bit. Here is Emmett's room, which I think looks so adorable. Very colorful, very animal themed. He is just eating right now. Um, what else did I switch up? I added some of the photos in. We have this picture we just took with Bobby. Um, I'm planning to have her take pictures with all of her friends and fill this up. So that's why it's kind of empty right now. And then she has her picture from prom with Natalie when they were teens. She's got this picture with Donnie and I gave her a little um, plant. I threw all this cat stuff in the living room, including this cat planter box that kind of looks like our kitty. She even has the black right here, just like our cat and the brown right here, just like our cat. <laughs> I still don't really know what to do with this whole big space here. I'll probably figure it out. It might just be a party area, but I moved the bar inside because it is spooky day. I was thinking we could have a spooky day party. This bathroom now has a sink and mirror, so it's more functional. <laughs> still needs decorations and 
accessories and toilet paper and all that stuff but she's running out of money so i figured i would stop i put some more photos on the wall here we have her parents wedding photo her picture with her sister as a teen her prom pictures and her sister's wedding photo i guess i don't have a picture of kai and dana's wedding which sucks but that's okay the downstairs bathroom now even has a shower and a sink not a mirror i guess i forgot to get one but <laughs> that's okay and then her office is what is the biggest change now this is a very overstimulating office it is so the opposite of minimalist it's like very maximalist <laughs> the patterned wallpaper with all of these different posters from all the games and different nerdy things that she um, likes i got her this new desk which i didn't even know this was in the game but i thought it was like perfect for her but yeah on the walls we just have all of these posters that i feel like are relevant to her so that is her office now almost fully renovated apparently there's music playing but i didn't put that on let's put on spooky i did go ahead and give her and emmett some spooky day costumes lately i'm having this glitch where i can't change the radio station i have to like turn it off and then turn it on to the station i want oh hey we have trick-or-treaters we're gonna treat this little kid or not because she is holding an infant so apparently she can't <laughs> let me go put him down how is he doing by the way he just needs to be so he's pretty much fine let's plop him up in his room just wanted to let you know you mean a lot to me and you're very sexy oh my god thanks donnie what <laughs> let me actually set up for a spooky day party i'm not gonna go crazy with the decorations but we need something right all right, now that we have like almost no money again, <laughs> all I did was put a couple of jack-o'-lanterns on the front porch. I'm gonna change the lighting inside to be like purple or green or something, which is what I usually do for spooky day. And I grabbed this candy bowl. You know what I think I should actually do is combine the living room with this room, just so when the music's playing, they can hear it over here. Okay, I think that's good. We have like an orange room, a green room, and a purple room. Um, and then I'm just gonna quickly throw up some random decorations, whatever the default. Sure, that's fine. <laughs> and let's start this spooky party. She's actually starving, but what are you doing, girl? The infants are kind of glitchy. I just had her wear a costume and I randomly clicked and I was not even paying one ounce of attention on what I clicked. And I chose Fairy of the Forest, which is pretty much the exact type of costume I went for, except using CC. So that's kind of funny. I just like aimlessly clicked on that because you have to do the wear costume to actually succeed in this tradition. But look at her costume. A CC version and it's a sexy version because you know what? She's been working so hard on her body. She's feeling confident and she just wants to go all out this Halloween. Um, all right, so let's plan this social event. Look at Emmett. He's a shark. <laughs> he looks like a little blob. Oh my God, so cute. So this is really an adult's spooky day party. We didn't invite any of the kids or like nieces, nephews, etc. because this is supposed to be for adults. Um, she's about to puke because she just uh, did a diaper change on him, but oh. I love how Natalie's outfit matches her hair like perfectly. Donnie is, what is he? I have no idea what he's supposed to be. <laughs> Some kind of retail worker. And then Hudson is a Sailor Moon pizza delivery guy. Kai, I don't know what he is because he just started boxing. <laughs> okay, um, I'm gonna have her come and grab a treat because she is a little bit hungry. I know that's not gonna fill up her hunger that much. And we should probably serve some actual food. Eva is a pirate. Um, Pari is a witch. What else? We have Bryson as an astronaut. Sakura as some kind of uh, like Star Trek thing. I don't know. <laughs> and then Bobby is a male lady. Oh my gosh. Amy is not wearing a costume, which is very bizarre. Because she would definitely be one to go all out. And it looks like our neighbor, Taylor, is trick-or-treating. <laughs> and what is our sis? I don't know what she's supposed to be. Maybe she's a character from something and I just don't know. Oh my god. 
So I really want her to attend the bar. I'm gonna have her... Why can't we attend the bar? She's too uncomfortable. Ugh, oh my god. Get over it, girl. Okay. In the meantime, I guess we should make some spooky treats for the party until she gets over herself. I think they changed this party because now there's definitely different tasks like performing mischief so socials. I don't remember that being a thing. Maybe I just don't do enough spooky parties, but I feel like spooky parties is one of the parties I do more than any other type because <laughs> I just really like Halloween. Oh no, Emmett's up here crying on the floor. Baby, just play with your toy. You're fine, dude. Okay, he's good. He's good. <laughs> it looks like Natalie's actually helping us cook. Who's this? Dana. <laughs> That's what Dana decided to be. I would not see her being that. I would expect her to be something a little sexier than that, but it's fine. Look at this nugget with this one little tooth. Looks like Donnie tried to help us cook too. She doesn't really need any pointers, guys. I think she's she's good. But thanks for the tips. <laughs> okay, now that she's done with that, have her eat like one cookie. And then she's gonna go ahead and tend this bar. Oh no, our cat is like freaking out from all these people being in our house. Okay, she's finally going to tend this bar. Hopefully someone orders something. Maybe we just make a drink for Donnie? Is it like she asks him what he wants and then makes it? I don't think I've ever done that interaction. We made him a sparkling water. I guess he's not really trying to drink right now. Interesting. Who else can we make a drink for? Let's get one for Natalie. Everyone's using her gym and it's so annoying. <laughs> like we're trying to have a spooky party. Get with the program people. And somebody put on a political channel or like the news in the middle of the party. Thank you for cleaning our house, Jade. <laughs> yeah, she definitely needs to work on that mixology skill, but hey, you gotta start somewhere, right? She's still level one. She's about to hit level two. That's good. We do have to max out mixology. Keep that in mind. Let's have her actually drink this one. Can she drink while tending the bar? I don't know. I guess not. Well, I'm gonna have her stop and just drink this thing. Hey. How's our baby? Oh no, he passed out on the floor. I'm sorry, dude. The, the infants are so needy. Needier than I could have ever imagined. Half the people are in their workout outfits because they keep using our gym. Oh my God. Let's come ask Donnie for a party treat because apparently we're supposed to do that. Actually, let's do one mischief thing. Like, let's scare him. Hopefully he doesn't get mad. How are we scaring him when he's staring right at us? It's not like we're actually surprising him. Oh, okay. At least he, he took it with good humor. She's like, can I have a spooky day treat? He said no. Bro, what? She's gonna ask soccer for a party treat instead then. Somebody give me a treat. Okay, thanks. At least Sakura has my back. We're not going to be carving pumpkins, so... Yeah, that's just not happening. Um, She's back to tending this bar. Just having her make random drinks and whoever takes it, takes it. Too bad she's spending her own money to do this, though. <laughs> I mean, that is more realistic, right? Oh, look at them being cute. Ooh, Jade, are you actually taking one of the drinks? And Sakura? Oh, okay. I think I will have to put some sort of stereo in this main party area because I can't really even hear it, but if I put it on loud, then it's like too loud. See? It's like super loud, but we'll just come in here. <laughs> Jade, whoa, she's having her second drink. <laughs> I think she did have a few drinks herself, so maybe she wants to actually woohoo at this party. Let's stop making drinks. She's just making out with Donnie. <laughs> and, well, that interaction still looks so funny to me. <laughs> um, I think they're actually gonna woohoo. Oh my God, please ignore the passed out infant on the floor. 
but they're actually going to go ahead and woohoo we're gonna end the party she's like okay guys party's over hopefully donnie doesn't leave if i end the party at least it was a silver level party oh my god look at her eyes like rolling back in her head <laughs> well that ended pretty good for these two even though the party wasn't up to my standards of like spooky vibes because she didn't have enough money to make a really good party but <laughs> oh no now she's going to check on the infant poor emmett oh my god i'm so sorry dude oh he's freaking starving i'm surprised he didn't get taken away let's quickly feed him i feel like he's not gonna do any of his milestones because he ages up i think on friday and i haven't done any of them yet I've been, I don't know, I think, I think they just require so much, like, attention that you, you can't even have your sim do anything else except focus 100% on the infant, which is probably realistic, I don't know. She has a shark biting her boob, oh my gosh. I love that Donnie just naturally stays over and she doesn't even have to ask him to. I want to try to introduce Donnie to Emmett, but he might be leaving. So hopefully, hopefully we can do this before he leaves. <laughs> I know she already like showed him off when he was a newborn to so Donnie, but okay, they're randomly gonna do this on the balcony. <laughs> I mean, that's kind of cute. Sweet! Aww, I hope the introduction goes well. <gasps> Aww, he looks like a natural. <laughs> he's laughing but it looks like emma is being a little bit grumpy but he did just wake up so that might be why can i do any interactions from emma's point of view let's see we can chomp him watch him smile at him and coo at him let's coo at him we have to make him want to be our stepdad <laughs> are we cooing at him i guess we are with a grumpy face. Yay! At least we have a positive Mishi. thing. Oh. Let's smile at him. Try your best, dude. Aww. <laughs> you can't help but love him, right, Donnie? Okay, um, we need to ask Donnie to move in. So I guess we failed the getting married in seven days thing, but I don't really care about that. Ask to join household. It's time. He's warmed up to the idea of being a dad. Whoa. I mean, he's always wanted to be one. He just wasn't ready yet. But maybe now that he has met Emmett, he's like, okay. I mean, he already knew Emmett, but you know what I mean. Should we take some of his money? Ooh, he wouldn't come in with no money. Like we have to take some of it. There's four of them there and there's like 40,000. So we'll just take 10,000. Yes, we got some money. Oh my. Okay, let's check on Donnie. Make sure he doesn't have any extracurricular activities going on. Okay, thank God. <laughs> Ooh, look how much he hates Dylan. Love that. But he should also dislike Aspen, so I'm fixing. He doesn't like our cat. <laughs> well, Midori's kind of a sassy kitten, so. Which I'm pretty sure she should have aged up by now. Yeah, it says zero days till age up. We might have to cheat that. I'm gonna cheat his relationships. I feel like he would be friends with Bobby and with Hudson. I like how he somehow knows our dead father <laughs> interesting okay so he actually does have a job he's in the athlete career i didn't even realize that what's up with his aspiration is this bugged i'm just gonna do extreme sports enthusiast for now we might change it why is it not showing anything for him? what the heck that is odd well, he's also trying to go to work so let me have him do that i'll fix his aspiration later i don't know what's going on with that but yeah, let's just leave this infant on the balcony. That's smart, guys. Real smart. I'm gonna have her take another moodlet solver. I think taking them while she has infants is probably the best thing to do. All right, I think since she doesn't have work today, I'll have her try to work on actually doing some of these, um, I don't know, like the infant things, even though it's already Wednesday and he ages up in two days. We can at least try to... How do we even do this? Play peekaboo, talk to Emmett? I don't know. I, don't, I thought there was something like tummy time or something like that. Oh, hey, our brother's coming over because we're a celebrity. 
<laughs> he's also a celebrity, so I don't know why he would need to do that. I don't know why she's, like, not interacting with him. I keep hitting talk to him, but he's just not... Do I don't know. Maybe I do need to see the infant's lesson. There was an option to show the infant's lesson. Ooh, okay, so I just read through the whole infant lesson thing. Apparently, you can apply baby proofing under the lock category. Um, interesting. I think maybe the infant milestones only are part of the um, growing together expansion pack, so maybe I don't even have to worry about that. Sweet. So I guess there's not much to do with infants if you don't have that um, expansion pack. Uh, I'll be getting that, hopefully, whenever it goes on more of a sale than it is currently on. <laughs> like maybe for Black Friday, we'll see. But I guess for now, I have it easy. I don't even have to deal with any of the, that stuff. But I thought you could at least feed them food. So maybe I have to get a high chair. Yeah, okay, so we can help him try his first baby food that we just fed him, so we don't really need to do that now. Um, have blowout. <gasps> oh, no. Ew. Oh, she can't handle this. She's a squeamish sim. Ew. <gasps> oh, my gosh. She's literally crying. She's like, no. <laughs> oh, gross. Gross. Yeah. Like how her first priority is to bathe herself. No, we gotta bathe the baby. All right, guys, and I think I'm gonna wrap this part up here. So if you enjoyed, please leave a like, comment, subscribe, share the video, and wait. Oh my God, we have to say yes. <laughs> Anyways, uh, what was I saying? Like, comment, subscribe, share the video, follow me on all my social media, please. For the question of the day, What's your favorite flavor of popcorn? Do you like a classic buttered popcorn or do you like caramel corn, cheddar popcorn? I think for me, caramel corn is really good, but I love just a classic movie theater, like buttered and salted popcorn. <laughs> All right, I will continue with this date in the next episode, which actually doesn't make any sense because how is he asking her on a date when he's literally at work and he's part of our household? I think the game's glitching out, but <laughs> I'm gonna go on this date, obviously, since they have to. I'll do it off camera, because whatever. And then I'll probably like exit my game and come back in so we can clear out any weird glitches that are happening. But anyways, I hope you guys have an amazing day, and I hope I'll see you next time. Bye! Proof that I'm doing it. I'm not cheating. I'm wondering if this is actually gonna glitch out, because he's in our household, but he just asked us on a date, and it's supposed to be one of those events where it's like showing up in the corner like, go on date but like you're not the one in control of the event so i might be having a glitch because this has taken a real long time to load <laughs> i'm gonna be so pissed